Uh, good morning, my name is Mariam Leachy. I'm Senior Workshop Technician here at Monash University where we teach fine arts, architecture, industrial design, digital media, quite a few subjects. These models here typically are first year model making models um, and we get them to incorporate all of the machines through mould making, through pattern making and so on. Their painting skills, thermoforming skills and assembly. So this is all thermoformed in separate pieces, so quite a complex mould to make that. Um, this also has some multiple thermoform parts in thicker plastics. This is an emergency response evacuation unit. But although it looks like a military vehicle, they're water cannons because we lost people in the bushfires. So for our lovely little old unit, it's, it gets a lot of use every semester. We've used all types of mediums in the thermoformer. This is a typical clay form process. So these are all hand shaped, and this is historically how it's done in the automotive industry. Things like that can work well because you can do undercuts and then remove the clay afterwards. Yeah. All right, so this is our Formec 300X, which has been with us here for over 20 years. Very serviceable, reliable. I don't have my timer present on this old machine. It didn't have a timer fitted, unlike the new equipment. So the student produces the turned pattern based on their design. They then thermoformed their mould and then incorporate that into their finished design, which is a little lamp and radio. It's inspired by a Formula Ford. 